Hey guys, this is Matt for Creative. Today we're here in Macy's at Herald Square. We're on their seventh floor and this is officially their Toys R Us section. So it's not the entire floor. It seems to be this back portion here, but we're gonna see exactly how this is and just how good it is compared to what Toys R Us was, which was a basic gigantic toy store. I lived in the suburbs, so that's really all I had. And wow, they actually do have a lot here. I just saw Star Wars stuff. That is gonna be pretty cool. So let's kind of just walk around. I'm gonna put this in wide so we can see everything. And it's all, it's just lines and lines of toys. The one thing that I do have to say right now is I know people are, they're into toys. They're into toys less than they were years and years ago. So that's why things aren't flying off the shelves. That's why things are, there's not so many toy stores anymore, but seeing something like this, where the shelves are not completely bare, it doesn't look like a bad experience. This just looks good. It's nice to have a toy store that's not just like this holiday theme, like um, what's the one by the Empire State Building or Rockefeller Center? That's a little something different. This is something that could just be here all the time, and I think that's what it's gonna be. It's just gonna be here all the time. Funko, a lot of things that I really don't know about here as well. So this is like a nice play area. It's big, it's wide, you just can like do anything here. You can sit down, you can rest. But this is just full of toys. Star Wars, Uno cards, Koga Melon. And again, a lot of stuff that I really don't know. But okay, I know Play-Doh, that stuff is around Blue's Clues. I know that too, but this is great. Just, oh, and there's even like a sale. There's like a last act sale section. So considering this just opened up, all this stuff is just to push merchandise out. So what is in here? Skateboards, Avengers stuff. All right, that's, oh my God. Look at the giant Hot Wheels here. That's pretty cool. I was into Hot Wheels, like a lot. I had a ton of Hot Wheels. I don't know where any of them are. They're probably all in storage right now, but it's kind of cool to see like a little display here. Oh, here's a hoverboard. I really thought that these were illegal now. Maybe this one isn't. There's, ner oh, there's, um, what do you call it? The wooden train sets. I used to love this stuff growing up. Oh, this is different. Imaginarium is not a brand that I would think for those old train sets. I thought it was something completely different. All right, so we got cars, we got Nerf guns in the back there. Nerf guns here, that's always cool. I wanna get one so I can shoot and the cats can go and chase them around. So later, I am definitely gonna be looking at these and seeing if I can find something that works. Now here we are in kind of like the younger education section with the VTech, the Leapfrog, the Fisher Price, the preschool. But as you can see, this is kind of where things end. Over there, that's kids' clothing. There's the McDonald's, there's everything. It kind of makes sense. The McDonald's is here on the same level that the Toys R Us is. Peppa Pig, Nickelodeon. This is just nice. It's kind of, again, what I thought it would be and what I thought it should be as a Toys R Us and not a holiday specific store, but something that you can get something all year round. And wow, they have some Kind of limited edition Star Wars stuff. Ooh, okay. All right. So you've kind of seen this walk around. You've seen everything that we have. I'm excited just to kind of walk around myself after this. But guys, if you have any questions, comments, anything, this has been a quick walkthrough of the new Toys R Us at Macy's at Herald Square. Again, any questions, comments, put in the comments section below. Don't forget, I'm on Instagram at m8b9. You can email me at matt8b9 at gmail.com. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Let's get that thumbnail.